Okay, so now let's bring up our Google Sheet that we have. Cool, so it's filled in the fields for us. Let's just resize these. And we can go and test this out if you want by clicking view in the type form and going and fill it in. And we use Zubi as an example. Press OK, press submit, and then we should have a result in our CSV. Perfect, okay. Now we've got that, let's go ahead and go over to Phantom Buster and create a phantom that's gonna watch for this new record and then go out and get the posts of this influencer. Okay, so go over to Phantom Buster, go over to the Phantom Buster store, search for Instagram, and then scroll down to find the Instagram posts extractor and then press use this phantom. Next, we're gonna need our session session cookie from our session ID then Instagram. So bring up Instagram in your browser, open it, inspect, application, cookies, scroll down to find your session ID and then copy the value. Back into Phantom Buster, paste that one in there. So now we have our session ID. In the next one, you're going to need the Instagram URL or spreadsheet URL. So if you want to do it simply, you can put in the Instagram URL. And what we're going to do, we're going to put in the spreadsheet URL. Get the shareable link. Make sure it's on edit just in case, because sometimes private ones can be funny. And then input that in here. So this is going to watch for the latest record and then go and fetch the post and we'll set up. Next, get the column name to where the, ins the Instagram profile link is. Put that in there. I'm going to want to extract the latest, um, let's say 20 posts. Number of lines, the spreadsheet to process per launch. We're going to want one because we want to do the most recent one. And the name of the resulting CSV is going to be Makerpad. Okay, now press save. Going to run this manually. You can obviously schedule this if you want as many times as you want to go if you're getting multiple people to fill it in. Going to go manual and then no notifications and then press save. So now if we launch this, it should go off and it should get Zuby's latest 20 posts um, and bring back those those posts with the information and also the link to the post as well, which we're going to want for the next part.